today we're going to be talking about one of our active literacy strategies for spelling, diacritical marking. In diacritical marking, there are three marks we use. We use a dot for a single sound, we use a line for a joined phoneme, and we use an arch for a split phoneme. When looking at some of our spelling words, we can diacritically mark each word. The first thing you should do is slow the word down and stretch it out so you can hear the sound. So the first word up here, cat, if we slow it down, cat, you can hear k as a single sound, a as a single sound, and t as a single sound. So cat, you can hear k, a, t. There are three sounds in cat. Our next word, that, when you slow it down and see it stretched out, you can hear th, a, t. The t, h, you don't hear individually, you hear as a joined sound, as th. So you mark that with a line. You hear a, t, th, a, t, that. There are three sounds in that. And our final word on this list, make. When you slow it down, make, you can hear m. Mm. The a becomes an a with your e. That is a split phoneme, so it gets an arch. And you hear the k. So you have m, mm, a, k. That is three sounds. Here are some primary seven pupils with some examples. And here is Iowa and Ailey to help us diacritically mark the word shop. So to first diacritically mark the word shop, we need to take the S and the H together to make a double sound sh. So you put a line under that. To take the O and the P, they are a single sound, so you put a dot underneath them. And there we go, we've diacritically marked the word shop. Now we're going to diacritically mark skate. The S is a single phoneme, so you put a dot under the S. The K is another single phoneme, so you put another dot under the K. The A has an arch over the T to join up to the E. And then lastly, the T is a single phoneme, and that means you put a dot under the T. Now we have successfully, successfully diacritically marked the word skate. So now we're going to diacritically mark the word mountain. So an M is a single sound, so you put a dot underneath it. The O and the U is a, a joined sound, so you put a line underneath them. And the N and the T are both singles. And the A and the I are joined. And the N is the dot. That is us diacritically marked the word mountain.